Today on the Marks and Bros Review, we're going to do a versus the Pelican case versus the Kong case. I got the Kong case uh, off of BattleBox, and it was about $39. It came in uh, one of their subscription deals, but the box is around $39 even on the internet. And nobody could ever tell you if it's waterproof or not. So we really don't know, but it has nice heavy duty latches, and when they open it up, it's full of stuffing. But it's got a rubber seal all around it, so I'm assuming that it's waterproof. And for half the price of the Pelican case, if it is waterproof and will withstand the water, then it's going to be well worth the money. I've had this case for a long time, and it's... I, I really don't know if it's water... I mean, it says it's waterproof, but we never tested it, uh, which, you know, it's always kept my gear waterproof but it's never really been in like a submergible. We're gonna submerge these for 24 hours and see, we're gonna take all the stuff, well, I've already took the stuffing out of here cause I had it cut out anyway for my GoPro and stuff like that. But we're going to uh, take all the stuff out and we're gonna fill it with toilet paper. So if it leaks just a little bit, you're gonna know. I'm going to put that in there. But these are, they're about half the price, but these these are tough boxes too. Here, take the, it's it, it, don't, it don't come out. We'll just glue it back in. I just leave it. I almost got her too. All right, so we're going to submerge them in water and see what happens. All right, I'm going to go ahead and put these in the can. Set those like that, and then I'm going to put this bucket on top of it to hold them down. Let me turn the water on. Okay, that's totally underwater, so we're going to come back in 24 hours and check it. All right, we just pulled these out of the water, and it's been about, tw they've been submerged for about 26 hours, and we haven't looked inside of them, so we put tissue paper on yesterday, so we will know if there's any leakage at all. So you want to open yours up first? Yep, it's full of water. It's got water in it? Yep. Yep. So it definitely leaked. It is not waterproof. Not worth the money. All right, let's try this one. That one leaked. That one leaked too. So neither one of them are worth the, worth. The so, water. But there's no there's no water in it. But I mean, what's that's soaked? This is too. So. Both of them leaked after 24 hours of being submerged, so neither one of them are, are waterproof. So uh, if I was going to spend money, I'd just spend it on this one. Yeah, you're go, you're going <laughs> to get bigger value. I mean, they might be wa more water resistant than they are waterproof, but it says waterproof. So we didn't, we didn't know about the Kong case. Yeah. So that was just a, we're just trying it out. Yeah, so. but it says right here on the back that it's waterproof, but that's... And it shows a guy pulling it through the ocean. <laughs> but I definitely, that definitely leaked. And it's still got the O-ring and everything fresh. So it's, it just leaked. There's nothing else I can say about it. But um, I hope you liked the review. And uh, thanks for watching and please subscribe. Thank you.